We are here. Search other eclair for Father Carter. Why the actual hotel? Since he was... Uh, I don't know which building I started the game. From quick news, I have now laser sights. A mother <laughs> chainsaw. Like, I think I'm pretty confident in my gameplay now. I could attach a laser sight to the bow, but not to this one. Like, I can't craft yet the one that could, but I'll find it eventually. Um... Oh wait, the tower is here. What? <laughs> you didn't see me. So if the tower is here, then that makes it uh, more interesting, I suppose. The doors are closed? I guess I was not coming from this side normally. Surely we'll have some interaction with Garrick now. Cause it's been a while. I don't really know where to go. I feel like I would have to essentially check the whole hotel. <laughs> Unless there is this place. Oh yeah, because it was next to the radio station. I feel like at this point zombies can't do shit against me. I'm just equipped crazily with stuff to kill them. Like my upgrades are a little bit nuts, like I almost have everything unlocked except for the guns because I don't use that match them, but they're still high. Like we started the game already halfway through, kind of. Okay, so that was here, no? But clearly we can't access it. Is there a tip? I mean, I guess inside. I don't think I've been in this room before. What? Garrick. 
Was there time before we met? I don't know anymore. Sure, there was growing up and taking our bumps and bruises, falling down, clawing our way back up. There was stumbling toward each other without knowing it, bathed in the darkness of innocence. Is there anything darker? But the dawn of everything was that moment, here, right on this patch of earth where we met. You remember it better than I do. You remember everything. That Tuesday afternoon was the of time. The time is running out. Walls are closing in. Look around. Even this sacred place has been corrupted. Alive, cutting through everything to reach us. Do not despair. And do not stop. You will find us. Time is definitely not on our side, so fuck time. Let's transcend it. May. There's one more place. <laughs> I wanna check. What was it? Like a singing uh, room? Maybe the tower will like guide me. <laughs> A moving target, huh? <laughs> oh my god. Wait. Finally! This is the place from the main menu. I was searching for it. Oh wow. <laughs> Screw helmets, dude. If they're patrolling here, something must be, like, nearby. Okay, no. <laughs> Another Garrick doing. I used to call you friend. Now. I spit in the mangled cavity that is your face. From this burden, we are free. Okay, well, um, back to searching. I was talking about this here. Um, what the hell is going on? Are 
Are you having a fun time? Hey Carter! Well... Hands off! So what do I do? Game? Get your hands away. Hands off. <sighs> God damn it, like I Oh, it's you. My flock, my friends, they're gone. Butchered. Yeah, there's a lot of that going around lately. Killing is contagious. Death comes for us all. Every sinner, every saint. No matter. The way you go, that is of consequence. Deep. What's got you waxing so poetic on death, Padre? Mama came to me with the proposition. If I turned my back on my people, she would welcome me into her inner circle. The Chosen, she called it. <laughs> Some nonsense like that. The fortunate few who would ride out the coming storm behind the safety of the tower walls. She said that my talents would be useful in the dark times ahead. Dark times? What's that about? She didn't elaborate. I railed at her with a rage I never knew was in me, spitting threats like a foul-mouthed brute. How dare she? I told her she would burn for her sins. How did she react? Mama said nothing. She just walked away. Two hours later, she returned in full force, slaughtered everyone. I ran and hid. In a hole. Like a filthy, despicable rat. Get it together, Padre. We need to talk. This is together. Good lord, my head. Swirling. I need more drink. I need to end this pain. Wait, you. You can help. <laughs> my god. No more booze. You're drunk as hell already. You need to listen to me. Wait, wait. No, 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 no. no. Uh, mother. I, I dropped her. Uh, speakeasy. But where? Where? God. God. My brain is useless. I'm finished. She's gone. Leave me. Let me rot. Not gonna happen. Sober your sorry ass up and put your business pants on. You made a deal, and you need to hold up your end. You are unrelenting, but so am I. You have my word. I will entertain your chat. But my mother, she must be with me. Take this. That gets you in. The soda machine in the alley. Clever. The speakeasy lies beyond it. She'll be in there. Somewhere. God, my infernal head won't stop spinning. My crucifix. Her ashes in there. So let me get this straight. All you need me to do is fetch a dinky fucking trinket for you and you'll get your head on straight? It's not just a trinket, tourist. To me, right now, it is everything. But yes, that is all I ask. Speak easy as hell, tourist. Incarnate. Infested. Would not take it lightly. <sighs> what do we mean nearby alley? Behind me? I have no words, kind of. I mean, it was right around the corner when I was entering and searching for things, but... 
uh, yeah, I don't know. I'll just search for that thing.